Welcome to another episode of Behind the Music Desk. Hey guys. Um, our theme for this week is Get Your Groove Back. Uh, and so Karina's gonna kick it off for us. What's our first song? Yeah, our first song is Pose by Jameson. My love. Yeah. Why does this song rock? <laughs> I love it, it so grooves. much. It makes me feel like a sexy badass. You can't listen to this song without strutting your stuff. Yes. Yeah. This song gives you confidence that you, quite frankly, don't have. Yeah, I totally understand that. Like, I listen, actually, all of Jameson's music makes me th- feel this way, especially this album. Like, the name of the album is Velvet, and every single track, that including tracks. Pose, it just makes me feel like I'm dressed in velvet. Like, I am, like, killing it on the streets, like, just walking, doing one of these. Yeah, I'm doing the head bop. You know, like the Everywhere intro- you go. <laughs> <laughs> the intro to Saturday Night Fever when John oh, Travolta is strutting. Yes! This could, like, be This could song. be that. You can overdub it over the soundtrack. Exactly. I'm going to do that right after we're done here. <laughs> that sounds like a really good idea. It is a good idea. Um, and our second song is Ta-da. Ta-da. By Masego. I should have done that. <laughs> By Masego. It's hard not to do. If it you hear this really song, it is very, it's it very is catchy. It is so catchy. Yeah, I love the title. It's, it's amazing. And, like, he... He freestyled this in the studio. Yeah, uh, with Fruit Kiwi Juice. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they did an improvisation and they uploaded it to YouTube. Yeah. And then this is the studio version of that improvisation original. Yes. Yeah. It's incredible. The guitar uh, that loops like the throughout band. the entire yeah. thing is gorgeous. The the harmonizing saxophones. Mm-hmm. I mean, you know me. He if just, you get a harmonizing saxophone, oh. I'm in it. I'm in it. And he describes his sound as like trap house jazz. And like you can really, really tell that he has a very clear like vision of what he wants to sound yeah. like because that is exactly what his music sounds like like he plays he literally plays a sax and like he knows his way around like jazz music but he also knows like a good good beat <laughs> he does yeah. the next song we have is by Mia Folick it's Stop Talking which I like a song that right off the bat do I know what it's about yes Stop Talking yeah yeah I she, love it I feel like the lyrics have a very Kate Nash vibe yeah mm-hmm. It's, a, but it's just like the lyrics. It's a very different sound. Yeah. But it does kind of sound like the thing that Kate Nash would write. Yeah. I love it. Also, she she like found her band on Tinder. She yeah. set up a profile. That is, I was just we like, love millennials. <laughs> yeah. I'm looking for a band. <laughs> and it happened. And this is that band. Wow. Honestly, the world works in mysterious ways. Yeah. That's a very productive use of Tinder. God bless Tinder. <laughs> Uh, so our last song is Only You by Philophius London featuring uh, Tame Impala. This song is fantastic. It was uh, originally a cover. I mean, it was originally by Steve Mon- Monet, Monet and, it, yeah. and it is a cover. Yes, it's absolutely amazing. I definitely think Kevin Parker, I love all of his work. Like He did stuff on Joanne and Lady Gaga's last album and he's done like tons and tons of producing work and this song was no different it was absolutely amazing yeah, yeah you can really feel his influence mm-hmm. on it. and you wouldn't necessarily think that that like that their sounds would go together but they think he adds something really interesting to it oh yeah 100%. yeah i was surprised to see that like it, how well it went together with like the dance hall inspired vocals mm-hmm. it feels like something that would get all the aunties on the dance floor oh 100 percent. they take off that nice sunday best hat place it on the table off that nice warm wool jacket, yeah. put on the chair, and they're like, oh, come on, kids, let's go dance. And they are killing it on the dance floor with their nice new blowout and everything. You I know? smell the hot comb now. Oh, I smell the hot comb as well. <laughs> and, like, that's exactly what he's trying to do with the song. I, I think definitely, so. I'm a mind reader. I know. That was his goal. Yeah, I like to think that Theophilus London would be like, you know what? I think it's time for something for the aunties. Something for the aunties. They're and he was right. killing it at the barbecues. Time to let him kill it on the dance floor. Aunties, get yes. your groove back. Yes, exactly. And that's the theme <laughs> of this week. <laughs> aunties, get your groove back. All right. And that's it for us on Behind the Music Desk this week. Catch us back next week for another amazing episode.